Uh, hi, uh, focus bloggers. Just a um, quick redo. I forgot, we forgot to uh, talk about a scholarly article. That's my fault. It was really late last night and I kind of just fell asleep. <laughs> but I am um, supposed to be at work right now, so I've kind of snuck off for like 10 quick minutes. But I'm not going to talk that long, I promise. Um, the article I found came out of the dailygreen.com, which is a side or it's part of Better Homes and Garden magazine. Don't know how much how, how scholarly that really is. But it, it's very interesting because I wanted to get uh, a magazine approach or get some kind of um, green objective uh, response to what was uh, what we're talking about here. So the Daily Green reviews no impact, and um, I've highlighted a few of the things that really stood out to me. Uh, one is that uh, this is coming from Brian Clark Howard, who is a web editor at the Daily Green, uh, and I quote him by saying, "But I thought the movie gave a thoughtful, enlightening look into his small family's sincere attempt to live greener." Um, this is another one. It's easy to try to dismiss Colin's year of living dangerously green as a gimmick, as a ploy for a book of film. Yet what comes across on screen is a truly dedicated, passionate guy who is really seeking for ways to live better. I couldn't agree more. Um, he is passionate. I said it in the other post that I thought he was passionate. He, but I just think his personality is not very likable. Um, so I do feel bad for him on that. And then it goes off to talk about his wife, Michelle. And how she does come around time and again, admitting that she liked the bikes and the spending more time together. Uh, because at the very beginning, she was not into it. And I didn't realize this, but the boots that she bought right before were $975. That is outrageous. Side note. So, just uh, looking at the scholarly article there. Let me see. What else? If there's anything else needed to talk about? Um, okay. So yeah, um, I hope you all enjoyed our trash and show this morning. Uh, we had fun doing it. So yeah, I hope everyone has a great break. See you Wednesday. Stay classy, internet. <laughs>